Dangerous weather comes in many forms, and when it comes to thunderstorms, there are several main threats, and there are actual criteria that classify a thunderstorm as severe. All thunderstorms generate potentially deadly lightning and can cause dangerous flooding, but it's the wind, the hail, and tornadoes that determine if a thunderstorm is to be called severe or not. The National Weather Service has issued a severe thunderstorm warning. When the National Weather Service issues a severe thunderstorm warning, they expect the storm to produce winds of 58 miles an hour or higher and or hail one inch or larger and or with the potential for spawning tornadoes. If warranted because of a radar indicated or witnessed funnel cloud or tornado on the ground, they'll also issue a tornado warning to replace the active severe thunderstorm warning. The 58 mile an hour wind and one inch hail criteria were chosen to classify a severe thunderstorm because they are both of a magnitude to create damage to property and a threat to personal safety. And even without tornadoes, severe thunderstorms can cause massive damage over a very long path. Straight line winds can be powerful and large scale wind events called derechos can spread hurricane force, widespread destruction over hundreds of miles and affect millions of people. An important phrase to remember with any thunderstorm is, when thunder roars, go indoors. Whoa! If a severe thunderstorm warning is issued for your area, get into a sturdy building and stay away from windows. Wind-driven debris and large hail can break windows and create a shower of glass you don't want to be in. For Weather Nation, I'm John Van Pelt.